are part of the uh, Crew-1 mission, and that means we are going up on the Crew Dragon, the SpaceX Crew Dragon vehicle. We're going to launch to the International Space Station and spend a full long-duration mission up there. We're following the DM-2 mission, which just recently landed, and one of the things that has to happen before we can go up is we have to actually look at the data from their mission. Bob and Doug did a test mission, and so that's really where they're verifying that the requirements of the vehicle are met. And then when we go up, we're actually going to put it through its operational paces. Uh, we're going to have a full crew of four instead of just two. We're going to stay up for a long duration, so that means six to seven months uh, versus the three to four months that Bob uh, stayed up. This is our, our Crew-1 patch. Along the bottom there are the symbols for all of the previous uh, U.S. launch vehicles, so Mercury, Gemini, Apollo Space Shuttle and that's flowing into the, the SpaceX NASA Crew Dragon and, and then all of that going up to the International Space Station. Our crew is four, that's all the seats in the Crew Dragon and that brings up the ability to uh, more efficiently and effectively conduct spacewalks, robotic operations and all those other things that we talked about, the science, the outreach and so again we will bring a full crew complement we will have a six to seven person crew on board the International Space Station. Uh, and then because of Demo 2, we will be able to continuously provide crews to and from the space station safely. Crew 1 is the first, what we're terming, operational mission of the Crew Dragon vehicle to the International Space Station. And what we mean by operational mission is that we are starting the phase where we are flying astronauts, NASA is flying astronauts to the International Space Station on commercial crew vehicles. Well, my mission will be uh, uh, help support the uh, commander and the pilot on uh, spacecraft uh, uh, Crew Dragon. And of course, once I arrive on the space station, I'll be a border engineer and do lots of science and maintenance and uh, spacewalks, robotics, all kinds of work. The important thing for us is, uh, of course, to keep the dream alive. And for this uh, commercial space program uh, is obviously Launch America. But for the rest of the uh, 7.4 billion people, the spacecraft of this century is not just for America, but this is an international corporation and all the other people around the world have a chance to ride on this crew drag. So this is a new era.